Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven Letter Squad? It's Try Hard Thursday. We're going to be Try Harding on a Thursday. We got a lot of really good gods open. This 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 player I'm fighting banned Vulcan, Zongkwe, Danza, and Medusa. Four gods that I... Well, I mean, Vulcan, I guess, kind of deserves a ban because he's got a pretty OP turret. But other than that, like, I don't know. A little bit of weird bans. He did ban Mammon and Hades, though, so... He knows some of the meta. I kind of want to play Bologna because AMC and on her are both open. But if I play Bologna into Anubis, don't I just get clappied? You know, I haven't played Ao Kuang in a long time. Let's play some Ao Kuang. And not only do I think Ao Kuang is like really strong, but like, or I'm sorry, not only do I have I not played him in a long time, I also think he's really strong. I think he's a he's a high tier citizen of duel. So um I think this should just be fine, really. Like I, I think Okay, the real question I need to worry about here. Let's go wing shard. The real question I need to worry about here is do I go Aegis or Beats? Because the reason I have to think about this is because if I go Aegis. I potentially lose any kill that I might have if he ults me. If I go beads and I can't take the Kraken damage, then I die anyway. Do we think... I'm just going to go beads. I'm going beads. Also, this um, this player's name is Temp two seven four one one five, with it with a hyphen. It doesn't mean that he's he is console who named himself Temp. It means that his name was bad and High Res removed it. In case you're wondering why his name is Temp, <laughs> my uh, my friend. His name is Yas. Uh, High Res has deemed his name bad because it has the word ass in it. Even though that's literally his name. <laughs> and uh, so he had the same situation happen. I don't think I'm scared of you at all. I think I'm just farming right now. Um, you're dead. Holy guacamole, baby. I had a 4 HP, I think. Did I just have 4 HP when I killed him? Or I had 4 or 15. It was either 4 or 15. For some reason, my brain's telling me I had 15, but my heart is telling me I had 4. <laughs> So I don't know which one is true. What, what, what do I believe here? My heart or my head? Either way, I will tell you this. Um, I do just want to say thank you guys. I am very appreciative of you. I know that um, Duel has been a real struggle for me to like get into recently because I try, you know, to do YouTube. I try to do a bunch of really fun things that like people don't really see often. Um, and I try to kind of keep it entertaining and new all the time. And it's really hard to come up with anything new after 5,000 duels or not even 5,000 duels. I'm sorry. 5,000 videos. I have 5,000 videos on my channel and it's really hard to like, you know, keep being new and energetic after 5,000 of the same thing. Um, however... Um, you know, I've expressed my, my disinterest in duel recently on Twitter and on Twitch that I think duel is in a really bad spot. And I do actually like, even when I'm winning and I'm in a good mood, I do actually think duel is in a really bad spot and I hope it gets changed dramatically in the new season. Um, I would, dude, I would love if we just like, we just got an entirely new duel. 
I know it's like insane to ask. Is why would they care about duel that much? But like, that would fill my heart with glee. But anyways, I just want to say thank you guys for um, a lot of the kind messages. A lot of people are still like, they're reaching out and being like, hey man, we know that you're having a hard time and we will watch your content even if you do conquest and joust and stuff like that. You know, like we'll watch anything you put out. I really appreciate it. Um, I have been thinking about maybe doing more joust content or maybe more conquest content. <laughs> I obviously haven't pulled the trigger on it yet, but uh, I do appreciate it, you know, and we've been getting a lot of subscribers. I know the, the views on the videos yesterday were really, really bad, uh, but they were only bad because I uploaded at 2 p.m. and then 8 p.m., which are really weird times to upload because I was really late to recording that day. Also, I could be washed. Who knows? <laughs> but but I choose to believe that it was a fluke rather than I'm washed. All right, we got the blue and we got the red. But yeah, so I just want to say thank you guys. I really, I really do appreciate all the kind words. I know that I don't really express it very often, like my appreciativeness to all of the viewers on YouTube. I say it all the time on Twitch, you know, people that subscribe and donate and, you know, do all that stuff over on Twitch. I say I appreciate them, but... You guys don't get it very much over on YouTube. And, you know, we've come a long way on YouTube as well. Not only me, but, like, the comment section was crazy back in the day. Like, a couple years ago, the comment section went ballistic. And now we're all, like, we're all vibing. We're all chilling. We're all, all having a good time. Ow. And, uh... Yeah, I mean, I, I just really appreciate you guys. So thank you so much for not only letting me do this as a career, which is just fucking insane. Like, as much as sometimes I dislike Smite and I want to switch up my content router or whatever, as often as that happens, and trust me, I, I do get annoyed with Smite like everyone does. Um, You know, nobody's perfect. Probably. Um, But... As annoyed as I do get, yeah, I still like it's a it's an absolute blessing, and I don't I don't overlook the fact that I'm able to play a video game as a career, which is astronomical odds to be able to do, and even more so with the positive community behind me and leading me forward even better. You know, it's like it's crazy. So thank you guys so much, seriously. And you guys don't need to, like, comment anything about me. I don't I don't need any compliments here. Because I know normally, like, if I, like, compliment you guys, you guys all like, Oh, Sam, you're the reason that we're here. And your positivity breeds positivity. You know, all that shit. I get it. I, I understand that, like, your en the energy you put out is the energy you get back. But, um, you know, I don't deserve y'all. I'll be honest. With you. I don't. I, I deserve if I if I got what I deserved I'd have a I'd have four viewers and all of them would tell me to die so <laughs> so I'm very grateful I'm very grateful for you all thank you so much no enough of that let's slaughter this guy he is Poseidon though so I can't really like get close to him at all I do need telekines I'm going typhons right now because you know life steal but uh i i do need telkines because it's gonna like literally double my damage because my auto attack chain on out kwong is so darn tootin fast that my actual damage output is so low so telkines almost straight up doubles your damage output perfect Honestly, let's just do this. Because my attack speed is so fast, I can slaughter the tower. Is my one clear? No, it does not. Um, is your blue actually up? It is. Nice. 
I think I'm actually going to delay the the Typhons and I'm just going to go straight to Alkynes and go to Bull Demon real quick. And while I'm going to Bull Demon, I'm going to tab out and read the message JTB sent to me. Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> so me and uh, JTB have been playing the new Modern Warfare 3 Zombies, which by the way, if you haven't played, it's actually quite good. It's It's really different. It's very, it's very different from normal Call of Duty. So if you're expecting the like round by round zombies that you're used to playing, then it, you'll be slapped in the face for sure. But um, I actually really like it. I think it's an improvement because, okay, hear me out. Well, no, I'm not gonna explain it. Maybe I'll explain it in another video if you guys actually care. Comment down below if you care, but um, the JTB sent me that he got the wonder weapon from the new zombies so he can shoot up into space now. <laughs> so because <laughs> when we were we were playing last night, I was streaming it. Oh god. Oh god. And um I got the wonder weapon twice while I was streaming it. I think you probably just lose here because I do so much damage. I mean, I'm five levels ahead. I'm five levels ahead, and I'm one of the biggest, like, damage dealers there is in the game. Like, I don't really need the greed on him much because like my my actual combo that I do is so much damage that uh greeting would just gonna be stupid. And I have Bancroft's life steal and I have Talkine's life steal, so like I don't really need to do too much here. Oh my god. There we go. There we go. GG. The GG 10 minute, 22 second Al Kwan game. Not bad to start off the try or Thursday. I'll see you guys in game number two, my boys and girls. Yo, what's going on boys? Game number two. Oh, we played Al Kwan already. I want to, I want to do a Kukulkin game. I play Kukulkin a lot and I know. Oh no, no. Oh no. <laughs> Oh God, this is bad. This is a bad matchup. Uh, the, I, I've got to get slot. Why is his, why is the, the nine offset from the middle there? That's, that is oddly triggering. That is so triggering. <laughs> oh no. This is bad though. I have no way to deal with his shield. Actually, you know what? You know what's good though? You know what is good? There is a positive. Okay, so let's run through the pros and cons of this matchup. Why I'm saying, oh no. For people that don't know why the matchup is bad, because why would you if you don't fucking live, breathe, and, and eat Smite? So the reason this matchup is bad is because Nemesis has a three. And Nemesis' three is the shield that reflects damage and also heals the damage that you deal to her. It will, instead of dealing damage to her, it will heal her for that amount. Um, hard CC effects will get rid of the shield. The problem with that in this matchup is that I have no hard CCs other than my ultimate, which is a knockup. However, my ultimate has to hit him to knock him up, which means that the damage will already be done by the time I get rid of his shield, right? So I have to play around his shield really heavily. The bright side of this whole dark debacle that is this matchup is that um, Kukulkin did get buffed recently to where his two not only cleanses slows like it used to because, you know, Kukulkin's two used to cleanse slows. Now he's actually completely slow immune for the entire duration of his two. So... It makes it very, very good for me to actually get away from him. 
because it, this used to be a worse matchup for me. Like, I used to not be able to um, get rid of his shield, and I would have to deal with his slows. Now, at least I can get rid of this, like, one of the two. I can get rid of the slows. Also, watch this. He's going to dash away. He dashed the wrong way. He made me look stupid. How dare he? <laughs> How dare he? You want XP campy? Can I hit him here? Darn. Well, he got the XP camps, but he's missing the entire wave, so I will take it. That is good for me. And missing an entire wave of XP is actually insane. Alright, I'm going to back out. I'm going to go Book of Thoth. I'm going to go a Health Chalice and sell that one. Next item. Oh, he's going Atalanta's bow. Is he just going move speed on me? I mean, that doesn't give move speed until he kills me, but. That's a weird item to start. I guess it does have 10 base pen. Actually. <laughs> that's kind of a good item. Like, that's a good early game item, isn't it? I'm down to fight you. I'm not scared of you. Uh, you're gonna run to Phoenix. He didn't even juke. Whose mans is this? Whose mans is this? <clears throat> he has made me look dumb twice. It's not that hard to make me look dumb, but he's done it twice. I don't like this, uh, this heartbeat back animation. It actually, it's actually spiking my heart rate, unironically. I know that people like the sound of heartbeats. I don't know why, because it's one of the most cringy things in the planet. I'm not saying that everyone should be dead. I'm just saying that the sound of a heartbeat makes me feel like my heart's going to explode. You know what I mean? So it just like riddles me with anxiety. Which is the opposite of what it's supposed to do. I know it comforts babies. I know that much. I know that you're supposed to like... Well, actually, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, hello. I'm going to run away from you now. With my slow immunity... I don't know if it's the skin on skin contact that comforts babies or if it's the you're dead by the way nice i don't know if it's the skin on skin contact that comforts the babies or if it's the heartbeat itself but i was told that it was the heartbeat so who knows it's probably both it's probably both oh also recently well, never mind. Never, never mind. No, I'll say it anyways, because I feel the need to defend myself. Um, recently, I said that people talking about me and Shiv having kids is weird because it just makes me think that they're thinking about my dick and her vagina. And a lot of the comments were like, uh, they're just talking about breeding a new conscience and all this stuff. I understand. I was, I was being hyperbolic. I was being exaggerated to get my point across that I think it's freaky that other people should have an opinion on having a child between two people. Like, I, I think that you should not, unless you see, unless you deem or unless the person that's trying to have a kid is like super bad, like they're a bad person and you know they wouldn't be a good parent, you should not have a say in whether they should have kids or not. At all. Ever. Because it's a very personal thing. It's a very life-altering thing for exactly two people. And nobody else matters. 
So when people come in and they're like, hey, when are you going to be a dad? I'm like, it's none of your goddamn business if I want to be a dad or if I don't want to be a dad. You know? And me, me saying the whole dick vagina thing was just me covering it up with humor like I always do. So I, that's why I said that. That's why I felt, I felt the need to defend myself because people were like hardcore roasting me about it. And that's not what I meant by it. I just meant, meant it as a joke. But I do think, like I said, I'll just want to reiterate. I do think it's creepy if you try to ask me if I'm going to have a kid and when I'm going to become a dad. Because it's not any of your business. <laughs> if it happens, if ha it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Simple as that. Anyway. Anyway. I just had to get that off my chest because it was irritating me. It's irritating me that... I feel like I'm... I feel like people are trying to control me. I know like 99% of the, the commenters don't care about what I'm talking about right now. And you guys are all awesome and stuff like that. But like there's one dude out there that's like, you should become a dad because it's your, it's your biological responsibility. You know? And that's the person I'm trying to get across that I don't need your opinion. I don't even I don't even want your opinion. In fact, I'll ban you if you give me your opinion. <laughs> I I feel like I I just have to say that, man. Anyways. Anyways, for the for the one person that got the memo, thank you so much for not being annoying. And for the one person that didn't get the memo, I don't like you. <laughs> Anyways, let's just let's just continue with the game. I feel like maybe I made people more mad saying that than I did before. I don't know. I I'm like very um Oh, that was a good hit. Are you dead from that? Oh, you are dead from that. Aegis? Doesn't matter. Oh my god. Um Yeah, I feel like people are going to get more mad about how I said that. I don't know. I I always think that people are going to get mad at me. I always think that I'm like doing the worst thing possible. You know? I think I'm safe here. Don't go for that wave. I'll kill you. Nice. Phoenix down. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That's good. Atalanta's Shogun's Hydra's? What is that? What? Oh my god. It went back. Nice. Nice. I was really trying to aim that ult because if I missed that ult, I couldn't have killed him. But if I hit the ult, I think he died. Um, how did that? Can I get the boys in here before I get clapped? No is the answer. No, 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 no. Slow. Auto attack. Run. Pump this down. Hide. Slow. I missed. Ah. Okay. 
I'm greedy. I'm a, I'm a greedy sack of shit. No poppy. Slow. Auto attack. Dash. Slow. Move. And no. GG. No. Oh, okay. GG. Nice. Bro. I died and ended the game so fast. I have a death in the bottom left, but not in the top middle. <laughs> That's wild. All right. GG Gamer. Game number two done. That was a fun one. I actually enjoyed that one. I was scared, but I guess for no reason, because even if I like, I can't get rid of his shield, but if he can't catch me, it doesn't matter. Slow immunity beats healing, I guess. <clears throat> That's crazy. I'll see you guys in the next game, though. Yo, what's up, gamers? Game number three. I'm going to hit up a little bit of Hera. You know? I'm, I'm <laughs> sorry. I was reading what JTV was sending me. <laughs> he's a little, he's a little tilted. He's a little tilted, I think. But, um, we're going to do a little bit of Hera because I. I mean, okay, I enjoy playing Hera to an extent. Um, I don't love it. If okay, hold on. If I let me think. If I go Chronos Pendant, Breastplate, Mirrodin, I'm over capping cooldown. If I go Bancroft's Breastplate and Mirrodin, I'm under capping cooldown. But if I go blue buff, I'm still capping. I'd rather over cap than oh, under cap. She never done me wrong. Obviously, if it gets to the hyper late game, it's better to go Bancroft's Typhons over Kronos because you don't need the cooldown. And I can always swip swap that around if I need to. Um, But for right now, I think I'm just going to go Kronos Pendant Breastplate. Oh, hello. Hello, dear friend. What are you doing? He is absolutely going to outclear me, by the way. I mean, if he put his spiders down, if he didn't, then he's not going to. Um, maybe he only put one spider down because our clear was kind of even, which is really surprising. You're not going to hit me. Relax. Relax, gamer. He just ran he ran right for me, bro. Instantly beased my two and just kept going. Respect. I respect that. I respect that. He's got a very no fuck around attitude. It's all or nothing, man. It's do or die. I like it. Alright. Let's clear the red buff now. And I already have Argus, so that's terrifying for him. This is a really good matchup for me, by the way. Like, I almost have nothing to worry about. Because if he gets close to me, then I hit him with my two. If he's far from me, then I just full combo him. And later in the game, he can't kill Argus. Neither can any objective. So... I don't really see how he wins this. Unless he gets like a lead somehow. He's maxing those spiders because they are tanky little shits. They are some tanky little shits already. <laughs> he is maxing them. Yeah, they did 216. Damn. Just auto these down. I'll grab the Kronos Pendant and I'll grab a HP Chalice, of course. Actually, instead of grabbing a Chalice, I could just grab Tier 1 Breastplate, which is better probably because 20 Prots is really good early game. I go from 30 physical Prots to 50. 
which is more than a 50% increase. So I'll fucking take it, dude. I just got 50% tanky. Not literally, like that's not how it works in Smite, but like in other games, yeah, I would be. <laughs> ah! Holy, dude. No, not like this. Not like this. How dare you land on me? How dare you think that you can land on me? Can I take this? I can, but I might die. Holy shit, you're fast. <laughs> no, please. Okay, Jesus, <laughs> he was zooming. <laughs> My guy was zooming at me. I did not think he'd be that fast. God damn. I'm popping this because I feel like he might invade. I was correct. I'm still dead. I'm alive. Mine. Please leave me alone. I want that red buff. I'm going to die. I'm doing dumb ass shit right now. My dad always said, if you're going to be dumb, you got to be tough. I better be tough as a motherfucker right now. Cause I'm, I'm stupid as hell. <laughs> Bonkaroos. Kablama blue. Dicks. It ain't that deep. It ain't that deep. It ain't that deep. It ain't that deep. You're dead. Let's go. Let's actually go, dude. All right, I'm safe. We got breastplate online. Uh, let's go, Polly. I feel like Polly will slap right now. Also, I'm I'm trying really, really hard to remember. That Polynomicon does not scale off of mana. It used to. A long time ago, it used to. And for some reason, I can't snap out of it. It scales off magical power, not mana. Used to scale off mana. Now it scales off magical power. It's okay. You don't need to keep believing in, in past demons, Sam. They're past. Is my two kill? Not even close. Not him, by the way. I meant the wave. Obviously, I don't think my two would have killed him at full HP. Oh, that would be sick, though. We're only five minutes in, already punching his Phoenix in the face. Max cooldown feels really good. On Hera. On a lot of gods, it feels good, but on Hera, it feels insane. And on Charon. Charon and, he and Hera. Oh, I missed. You are really fast. Just thought I'd let you know in case you didn't. What if I just did Bold even? Can he see me still? Revealed the enemy. Damn. Alright, so I'm going to do this. So that he thinks that I'm doing it, and then I'm going to wait for him. Oh. He saw me cringing him. I suck. Don't walk towards me. Who do you think you are? Don't walk towards me. No siree. Wait, he can actually just run from Argus because he's he's that fast. That's pretty insane. That's a pretty fast spider. I guess spiders are fast, huh? Those little shits. Dude. 
There was a spider in my house the other day. And, um... It was, like, on the floor. And I slapped it off. Fuck out of that thing. <laughs> oh, lucky like, no. I, I know... I, I know... There's going to be people that are like, hey, Sam, you shouldn't kill spiders. They're like good for the environment and shit. They like kill all the insects and stuff. But this spider was in my home. I won't kill you if I see you outside. That goes that goes for humans too, arguably. As long as you don't invade my home, I won't kill you. <laughs> but, um, dude, I slapped it palm down. And he imploded. I know you guys don't care, but I, you know, I remember. I beat the IRL Arachne. I still can't kill these little shits with my two. I'm maxing my three because I don't want to die, but I feel like I need to put another point in my two because I need to like start killing the spiders with it. Ow. That like unironically does so much damage. What is this? I'm just slowly poking his uh slowly poking his What is that? Phoenix. That's a Phoenix. I'm fine with this. Perfect. Dude, Argus just tanked the... Argus just tanked like 11 Phoenix shots. Bro, Hera is disgusting. Actually grotesque. I've made errors. There's errors in my place here. Please stop. He has blink and hasten katana. I'm actually so dead it hurts. I'm aging. Get him, fire minions. Holy guacamole, dude. Thank God for fire minions, because that guy was slapping the shit out of me. I have almost 4,000 gold, I've just realized. Um, I do want Mirrodin. Yeah, whatever. I want Mirrodin. I'm going to go Mirrodin and Tier 2 Rod. What's that power spike I just got? How much power is that? 60 plus 75? I got 135 power. Plus 20% increased damage when I alt. So basically, here's my plan. I alt and then I two. Well, like I two during the knockup. So I guarantee the two and then I one. Because he's he's slow during the two. So that combo should clap. Assuming I hit it. That is. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, I mean... He hit me with three auto attacks. I hit him with Argus... Eight times. My two twice. Five ticks of my shield. And my one. 
<laughs> and my poly and two autos. Hey, that's just a losing matchup. I'm sorry that you had that matchup. You, you might beat me in a different one, but that one is just, that's impossible. I'm sorry. Um, I'll see you guys next game. Yo, what's up gamers? This guy actually banned a bunch of stuff that's like really good and it scares me. So I'm going to try hard. A newbie? A newbie on my booby servers? Oh my. I have a text from my oh from my wife. She said I love you. I love you too, baby. Um I must check in for my appointment today. Annoying. Uh you know what's what's cool? Is uh I think this might be my last follow up appointment from the hospital visit a while ago, which is really good. It's very good. I'm, I'm, it's like, it's so annoying. I have in the past, what I had to go to the hospital on like the fourth or the fifth or something like that. In the past two weeks, I've gone to the doctor six times. Oh my God. I'm so over it. I'm so over it, dude. But today is hopefully my last follow-up appointment for that. And I should be looking all healthy and all good. I mean, I don't know. I guess I shouldn't say that now because they're going to tell me what they saw in the CT scan today. So, But I assume if it was something bad, they probably would have hit me up and be like, hey, dude, you're fucked, you know? <laughs> like, <laughs> I, assume they, I assume they're not going to say that to me. Can I have that, please? Nice. Nice. He got the blue, but I got the kill, so I'll take it. Can I get this in time, even? I can. Nice. Where is he? I don't know where he is. Did he go to my blue? I don't know what he was doing. Maybe he was raging. <laughs> Maybe he was just he was just in his base punching the air, you know? <laughs> like trying to figure out where it all went wrong. <laughs> We've all been there, buddy. We've all been there, trust me. Some of us more than others. Me. Me, that's what I'm saying. It's me. Alright, I got a back because I got no mana and 200 health. All right, Bancroft's Talon, uh, this and this. I don't really think he can kill me. Am I alone in my assumption there? I feel like I'm kind of invincible. Hello? What are you doing? Ow. He's saving his three for the wave, I guess. I'm just going to clear. Don't hit me. We can all be buddies. It missed. Oh, dickies. Damn. I should have ulted and then dashed into him. That was stupid. He's got no mana. My poor guy. My poor guy. He had no mana. He was going for it, but the no mana really, really beat him to the punch. He's doing some Towie damage. Get some wave clear going. Can I get this? 
Oh my god, I can. Okay. I have no mana, but uh, like, hopefully I just don't die here. Nice. He's giving me the blue buff. He's playing a little scared. I mean, I guess to be fair though, I did invade him and kill him and take his... Well, I was going to say take his buff. I didn't, I didn't get the blue buff. I didn't get the blue buff when I invaded him, but I did kill him <coughs> and made him punch air for a little bit, so... Oh. Red buff is spawning. I will be there. The good old 2-1. I'm just going to detonate so I kill it a little bit faster so I can back. 2200 i kind of want to go pestilence but because i don't have enough gold for pestilence i'm just gonna run the uh the genji's pestilence is 2400 so if i had enough for it for sure i buy that instead but it's fine no one ever's complained about cooldown right so well nobody ever complained about having cooldown there's plenty of times where i've complained about why does this guy not have cooldowns you know <laughs> All right, let's get the blue buff here and just keep farming really heavy. You know, a lot of people will ask me, um, like, hey, Sam, what do you think you're best at in Smite? And they assume that my answer will be like, you know, the mages or assassins or hunters. My answer is farming. It's always farming. Because I'm like, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, that's a five minute surrender. GG's Anubis. But it doesn't really matter what god I'm playing. I am good at farming. I'm good at taking the opportunity and the time to farm when I see an opening for it. Even if it's a little bit greedy. Or in my case, a lot of greedy sometimes. But I think the, my best asset to a team in Conquest is the farm I bring. And... I'll always be higher level than everyone else because that's just what I do. I don't know why. I don't know why. I'm just good at it. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next game. Yo, what's good, boys? Welcome back to game number five, I think, maybe. Maybe game number five here. Fighting a soul. I'm playing a Chiron game. Chiron is sick. I like Chiron. He's always so much fun. And he, he's like one of those gods that, excuse me, Jesus, he's uh he's one of those gods that you don't even know about. Like you don't even remember exists until you're in a game and you get clapped by him. And you're like, dude, Chiron is so good. And then the game ends and you forget he exists again. You know what I mean? He's one of those gods. But I actually really enjoy him. I don't like this jump animation. Look at my spine. Look at my spine when I jump. Like, look at the... Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. It, like, folds in on itself. Oh, that cannot be healthy. That cannot be healthy. You think he's going to invade me? Because I invaded him last game. It's the same guy, right? This is the Anubis. I'm going to go to red buff. Oh, you're going to red buff. I'll go to red buff. Honestly, screw it. I'm down. Let's 50 50. Nice. Look, I have red buff, right? I should not lose this. Oh, I missed. Oh, that was close. Pop him with an auto. Hit the one, hit the one, hit the one, hit the two. Oh my god. Look at that damage, baby. Look at that damage. Now you're going to back. I'm going to do your blue buff. And everyone's going to go on their merry way. Agreed? <laughs> Perfect. I don't have any mana, which sucks. But I don't know if I need that much mana to fight him. 
I just need to hit him with my one of my two. I hit him with neither. And now I run away. Do I alt my, my blue? I don't think so. My alt doesn't do enough damage to warrant that kind of behavior. Get those once more. All right. I got triple buff. He can get the XP camp and still hit level five though. But that's okay. That's all right. Nice. My bow is finished. Well, not finished, finished, but we got the tier one step. Um, I could fight him. I just don't think he wants to fight me. Never mind. Ow. Okay, my damage is actually crazy good right now. Oh. Whoa, that ult was crazy. Um, I want to go for the kill here because he has no ult. Oh, that hit him. That's good. Oh, no. No. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. You're dead. My two. No, my two. I got you baited, bro. There's no way. Oh, man. I actually had enough H HP to do red buff because of my passive. I want to go beat stick. Yeah, soul's healing plus Bancroft's like I'm never I'm never ever going to be able to kill him when he gets low HP. Cuz he gets the healing from his one based on how much HP he's missing and Bancroft's gets stronger based on how much HP he's missing. So if I don't go beat stick, I'll just never kill him. Unless he like full commits to a fight, but I don't I mean it doesn't seem like he wants to. Damn it. Let's do your blue. <clears throat> do the treasure chest while I'm at it. Why not? Nice. All right, nice juke. Nice juke. Um. God damn that damage, dude. I'm telling you, man, Chiron. This guy's crazy. He's actually crazy. I don't get Phoenix, but that's okay. Let's go back. I mean, I, I want to greed the XP camp here. Probably stupid. But I'm doing it anyways. Um... Dude. I kind of just want to fight again. All right. All right. All right. I'll back. I'll back. Let's grab brawlers. Let's grab tier two Genjis. A couple of potions. And then I'm actually going to go blink because I can go hyper aggro here and actually demolish. Um, actually demolish him. 
If he uses his three a little bit too liberally, then I can blink on him afterwards. He needs to be very careful. Oh my god. Uh, he's being very careful. <laughs> All the way in his Phoenix, man. All right. Let's go get red buffed in. Excuse me. Oh, good. He wasted it. Nice. GG, dude. Oh, I was stressed on that one. I was a little bit stressed. GG's gamer. And I will play one more game. I, I got time for one more game to do here. So I'm down for that, boys. I'm down for one more game. Let's get it. GG. I'll see you there. Yo, what up, boys? The last game of the video, I'm going to whip out the Masters Border Freya. The unlost Freya. And uh, I'm going to punch a, a couple heads, man. Punch a couple heads. Just whip out the Masters border. You never know. I'm fighting Shuji again. Good old Shuji. The past... This is my third game. There, I think this is either the sixth or the seventh game of the video. And this is my third game against him. He's half of the video, dude. That's sick. It's actually good because he said that he was um he said he was a viewer. It's, he said my second game on today and it's against you. My favorite YouTuber is what he called me. Mm. Makes me so happy. He's so happy. Maybe I shouldn't invade him if he called me his favorite YouTuber. He'll become a Rexy main after this. <laughs> or a Christy Dixon main. They are good people to main, I'll be honest. Not better than me, obviously. Dude, I've been playing so much Modern Warfare 3 that I just tried to sprint. I just tried to sprint in smite with my shift key. Are you doing red? Oh, there he is. Ow. I think he wanted to go do red, but he was just too late. He seems very busy. Like, he, he doesn't get time to focus on smite. I'm never going to kill you. You have backflip. If you didn't have backflip, sure. Okay, you've killed yourself, I think. Nice. Nice. Just the absolute demolition of early game Freya with a horrific and wing shard. Level four, W King under tower, killing him. It's so dumb, man. It's so dumb. Freya is so strong, man. <laughs> I feel like people don't understand just how strong Freya is. Which is probably a good thing for me. Because if I had to fight 100 Freyas, I'd lose my mind. I can I can just kill you again, by the way. Unless I miss everything. Oh, 
Nice. I wonder if he's gonna ult me. I mean, that ult won't kill me. I have 400 health. Even if he did ult me. I do want to go Bancrofts here. But I, I think I might just go Berserkers. Now this is some I think I might just forego any kind of... Uh, Lifesteal this. I mean, tel Telekines has Lifesteal, but like... I don't want Polly or Bancrofts or anything. I just want to go straight attack speed. I do need mana though. Which is stink. Holy crap, that attack speed slow from his two is actually brutal. Should we try to corner this guy? Should we try the Sam the Dude corner on a viewer? He's just wait. Maybe he heard me. Maybe he heard me autoing the uh the treasure chest down. Or he's just being really passive. I don't know. He's just kind of standing there. Like I said, he seems so busy. He seems like he can't even focus on playing the game. I don't know why. It seems weird to me that like... That you would queue. If you don't think that you can actually play the game. It, it, it's like this is like his third game in the row because he's not he's not going to be able to win if half of the game he's not playing you know I missed. I thought for sure that was a kill, but I'm sucked. I'm sucking on butt. Oh, man. I can't catch him. All right. All right. That's fine. We full clear the wave. We go get berserkers. What is this? What are, what are you doing? Berserk. What are you doing? Now we get berserkers. Now we go toxic blade. I'm going to grab some mana pots because my mana is an issue. It is absolutely an issue. Let me grab this. Man, that attack speed feels so nice already. The, uh, the Bancroft start is definitely better for mana and also health sustain. So the Bancroft start is arguably better, but the attack speed you get from Telecon's Berserkers is so insane. It's so hard to, like, want to start Bancrofts when you know how much attack speed you get from this this build because attack speed is like directly correlated to how much damage you're dealing at least with Freya just doing some damage there let's get this blue buff Nice. And red buff is up as well. I, I should have picked up that blue buff, honestly. I don't think I have time to go back. Maybe I'll try. 
And I'll see if I can go pick it up. Nice. All right. Um. I he bought breastplate. I. Should I message him? I'm a mage. Like, I, not even in an insulting way, but just like, if you want a chance to win this game, you have to go magic defense. You can't even, you can't go. I mean, I the cooldown is good. Bro, got me shaking in my boots. <laughs> Yo, I got him twisted up. I got him twisted. <laughs> Did you switch it? You didn't even switch it yet, man. Oh, that's funny. What is this matchmaking though? Honestly, I have no idea. Matchmaking in Smite, or not even in Smite. Matchmaking, Smite's matchmaking is actually using a really good system. However, um for duel duel specifically there's not enough players uh there's not enough players to match correctly in conquest there's a lot more players so the the conquest lobbies are a little bit better they're still terrible because smite still has a lower player base but um overall it is better i was just watching your mom and mirror game and then this I think I used Mammon against him. Wasn't that the first game? I think the first game was my Mammon versus his Anubis. GG gamer. All right, that's gonna call it here, boys. For the uh, try hard Thursday, I had a lot of fun today. Um, well, video will come out faster. I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys did as well. Um leave comments on the earlier conversations i would love to read them what your opinions are uh i know i have oh i got the mifflin announcer pack i'll say gg one more time uh, i know i have this weird like in my i don't know if it's anxiety or for i'm just like panicked for whatever reason but i just feel like everyone's gonna hate me for every opinion i have so the comments will tell me if that's true or not um <laughs> so leave a comment and I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.